Welcome to this ship review of the Anvil Pisces 38R, a medical rescue ship and we're going right into it to see what I see as the benefits and what is great on the ship and what it might be bring some challenges, but let's get into it. 07 Citizens, X-Wings X speaking. I appreciate you joining this video and watching on my channels. Please like and subscribe if what I'm doing is helping you. Let me know in the comment sections what worked well for you, what I might like to do differently and what else you would like to see on this channel. Ship specification of the 38 are 30 meter lengths, a beam of 10 meter, a height of 3.2, harpoon sizes are small and the max speed is 164 meters per second. Minimal cruise 1, you have maximum 2, you have one additional seat in the ship. The entrance to this ship is through the rear, there is a big cargo hatch to get into the ship and bring the people onto your medical bed. Another feature that this ship has, you can, when, as you put out the landing gear, the tips of the wings in the back will fold up and give you additional space for getting into close, as close as possible to the people. Of course, there is the ambulance lights, they are needed so people see, we're an ambulance, we're not here for fighting, we're here for supporting and helping the people. So please, don't shoot us. Don't worry, you still get shot. <laughs> It's still an MMO. Another thing that needs to be mentioned is the medical bed that is in this ship. It's a tier three, so this means you. This is for stabilization. This is really a first responding ship. This is not like a, a hospital ship, but you can put people onto the bed and carry them up to the next station, where they actually get proper support, where you ha can cure tier two or tier one medical injuries but still you're here to help you bring the people out you can save their lives, their equipment and all the things they need to be helped with. Good things to have in this ship is the possibility to have for your patients order, treatments, markers, you got food in here pretty, pretty much everything a people need that comes out of uh, a challenging situation. Additional storage here for patients oops, what's going on in the back? <laughs> We're around the station. So patient storage here, crew storage here, and of course the big hatch to get out of this ship. Another an additional seat for your first responder, for your helper to be ready to get the people on board. The downside is the shields of this ship are really not strong. Not strong at all. So you can land properly and you have space, but as soon as you approach a bunker that has hurts on, it looks quite different. Down. Bang. <laughs> so you really, really need to get swift. As soon as you get radar locked below 1500, you get shot at, you need to move. And you see how quickly red it gets down there. So you are, you have to, you really have to walk in to turret guarded bunkers if you want to save the people in there. This means as we have no cargo space for a ground vehicle, we run and run and we run more and we're still running yes until we're there and we actually finally able to bring out the people back to our ships now here's a good not a good thing to tell you about this ship in 318 you recover it with in 43 seconds when you claim it 43 seconds that's freaking amazing and you pay less than 300 AUEC this is gonna be different in 319 four minutes respawn time and a bit more than 3000 AUEC to actually get it so this is one of the big changes for 318 uh, 319 for this ship last but not least you can spawn it everywhere even on outposts outposts on the platinum base where you usually just spawn the ground vehicles I really like this ship I hope you like this review. Let me know. This is X Wings X, over and out.